What? <laughs> what, what, what? Wait, what, what did you say? I thought it'd be a little louder in here. Well, you can bet it will be a little louder on Sunday night for game two. Paul Pierce, will Kyrie bounce back Sunday night, and will it be enough for the Mavericks to win? Well, when you talk like that, I expect it. I mean, Kyrie mm. is a great player. Uh, I expect him to bounce back. I don't expect him to go six for 19 once again. But let's just say, let's just say, and you guys, you and Key, if, y'all favorite word, if, if Kyrie makes... Four more shots. He's 10 for 19. That'll give him eight points. Let's say three of those shots was threes. That's nine points. One was a two. That's 11 points. That put him at 23. They still down nine points. I don't expect Jason Tatum to play the way he plays, Skip. Mm. I mean, so regardless of you, however you want to slice it, we, we can say Kyrie's going to bounce back. Let's say Lucas does, does the same thing he does. Jason Tatum is not going to go six for 16. This, like, like I said, mm. it's just not going to happen. I mean, yeah, you can say it was an aberration. Christoph Porzingis, eight for 13. He just unbelievably 20 points. Whatever. I'm good with Porzingis giving us 12, 13 points. He can get that in his sleep. I continue to look at the stat sheet. I continue to analyze this game. And I keep saying, what adjustments do you make if you're Dallas? What adjustments? I just don't see an adjustment out there because game one is telling. Game one can tell you a lot about a team. You look at the matchups, you look at the style of play, you see, you look at the defensive assignments. It's little things that you break down about the game that I watch. And I say, like I said in the Minnesota series after that one game, I was like, Man, I thought this game would go seven, but when I look at all, when I break it down, I, I, I think Dallas gets them in five. And I said that before the series, Dallas in five. And I just don't know where Dallas goes from here. Luka played great. Mm. He, I mean, maybe not great, but Luka did Luka things, and I, I, I can't put a finger on it. Like, if I'm Jason Kidd today, I'm watching film, and I'm going over the defensive scout report, and I'm just like, what? I, I, I'm confused. I'm confused because when you, Porzingis is just such a cheat code. He's such an X factor. Do we switch it? Do we trap? Do we, then you unlock these other guys. This is what I'm saying. So, and Kyrie's saying, is it going to be a little louder? You damn right it's going to be a little louder, Kyrie. <laughs> I'm going to be in the building game too. Mm. It's going to be a lot louder. Mm. Thanks to you. You gonna be screaming and yelling? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna be screaming and yelling. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta say your voice for television, man. Mm. Yeah. Um, <laughs> damn right, it's gonna be a lot louder then. If you didn't hear us before, you're gonna hear us game too. You know, it's, it, it's my experience in at home or on the road, when things are so lopsided, you're not gonna really get a loud noise. You're just not. Think about it, Skip. The Mavs were up at one point by one or two in the first quarter. Then they got on the Porzingis road. So now you get on the Porzingis road, that crowd was uh, elevated. I you, it was pretty loud then. It was then. pretty loud. Yeah, was pretty but loud, then all yeah. of a sudden, when we you are up by 29 and 7, it ain't nothing to cheer for. It, it's, it's not going to be loud. <laughs> it's like, we don't need to be loud though, from the first quarter to the fourth quarter. And by the way, when Luca cut it to eight, it was probably pretty quiet in there. It was quiet, yeah. then it got loud again when they yeah. went back up to yeah. 22. Mm -hmm. So I get what Kai is saying. Now, when you talk about him bouncing back, well, I don't I think he's going to ever be 6 and 19, 0 from 5 and minus 19. I, I just don't think that a guy like this, this type of play, is going to stay the same. He's going to increase his play. There's just no question about it. Mm -hmm. He's going to make that necessary adjustment. But the Celtics are gonna make the adjustment too with him. They're not gonna just let him go 19 to 19. They just not gonna do it. They're not gonna close their eyes and be like, okay, you can shoot. They gonna, because they made mistakes mm. when he had those wide open jumpers. They made mistakes. They're gonna try to fix that. He'll play better next time around. I still don't think they'll win the game. As of right now, the line says uh Boston by seven. So, yeah. you know, I think it, I think that's safe to say they're gonna cover. You know, I, I, I'm safe to say they're going to cover, but in the end, he's got to play better. He knows he's got to play better. He will play better, but I don't think they'll win. All right.
So I believe, and I'm looking at the glasses half full with Kyrie Irving, that he wrote a check last night that he has to cash. And he's smart enough and experienced enough and he's been around enough to know exactly what he was saying sitting at that podium when he said, I thought it would be a little louder in here. He's calling out Celtic fans because he needs them to call him out. He, he needs them to come after him so that he will respond the way he has responded in the past. And he will hear that stat. He's now 0 for his last 11 against the Boston Celtics. And I believe in Kyrie Irving, and I believe he's going to have a big bounce back game in game two because he owes his team a game two. 0 for 5 from 3 was just unacceptable. He drove me crazy. My little Maltese Hazel watches every game with me. She's <laughs> looking at me like, what are you doing? Because I'm screaming some words I'm not proud of at Kyrie Irving. Because can we see what happened last night with his five threes? You, you have to make a couple of these. I want you to narrate either. those words as yeah. you're watching the highlights. Yeah, exactly. I just <laughs> toss in oh, some of goodness. these. Was that off the side of the yeah, backboard? Yeah, hit the backboard. Yep. <laughs> Come on, Kyrie. Wide That's open, just like wide. nobody's within 15 feet, and you can't make that. Wide, and I'm just screaming. It was open? at the first, yeah. No, I expect yeah. them to hit some. Come on, that's wide open. Come on, Kyrie, just one. Just give me one. Just, just one. All right, give me because two. Because they're momentum breakers. Just they're, they're one. like, oh, uh oh, he joined. You know, he just came to the party now, and we, we got to now we got to go. Oh, for five. So he kept getting the crowd back into it and back into it and back into it, in ways that that you're right. Dallas can't win that way. But mainly, Dallas can't win with Luka having one assist. Well, what's the biggest reason he had one assist? Because other than him and the starting lineup, the, re the other four went one of 10 from three. And the rest of the team went three of 15 from three. Well, he and was it, four of 12. It yeah. ain't like he <coughs> No, but, but I'll, I'll, for him, I'll take four of 12. Yeah, I'll take the, that. Yeah, but I don't four. need him I'll shooting 12 that. times, though. I don't, yeah. I don't need All right. that. All right. But the point was, look. If your Boston Celtics are going to outscore the Mavericks in game two by 27 from the three-point line, you got me. You're going to win that game. Well, we got you then. And if Kristaps Porzingis <laughs> is going to come off the bench and give you 18 points in his first 13 minutes, you got me again. Uh, well, we got you again. Because you're going to sweep. If he what does that it? every game, you're going to sweep. Well, it's a sweep. Okay. Game. Yeah, you, you guarantee in this? It's a sweep. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to go sweep? Gentlemen sweep right no, now. You, well, well, sweep why, right now. why wouldn't you have the guts to just go full throttle? Huh? Sweep. Do do sweep. Then we better, By the way, you, then we you, better dinner last you, night. You did, and you got me, and you still owe me two dinners. You, you're still down two. We got so, and we, we got a long way to go here. Way to so, go. Skip, if if Luca does what Luca does, which his point total says. Okay, he but, did. but the point was, why did he have one assist? Because nobody cashed any of his passes. He's no, a kick out pass. We passer. defended the pick yeah. and roll well. How about that? Give us some credit. Okay, give no lob some, dunks. I'll give, give you no lob dunks. We took away yeah. the lob dunks. You did. A couple times, Jalen Brown you, blocked. Porzingis was at the rim to meet him there. Yeah. Like, it was the defense, Skip. Don't say they just missed shots. Okay, we can say Kyrie went 0 for 5. We saw some open shots. But give yeah, credit to where Kyrie went 0 for 5. That, those were kicks from Luka. Yeah, but I'm he, saying... He like, walked into a couple of those. The Celtics didn't play well to me. They didn't. Yeah, they shot 38 from 3. That's pretty good. We'll take that. 47 from the field, but when I look, who, who, who are you going to look at and be like, man, the Celtics won, but I'm, yeah, you'll say Porzingis. But it was, a, it was a team effort, though. Yeah, that's, that's what, what I'm like, saying. Man. And I keep effort. telling you, and I'm going to keep telling you this. Uh -huh. Dallas has no room for error versus the Celtics. I say this, and I will continue to say this. If these two nuclear weapons that Dallas supposedly have mm. don't go off, they have no chance because on our side, yeah. we got about four nuclear weapons. Four of them. So if they don't go off every game, it's going to be impossible for Dallas to be in this series. Okay, here's the point. These games mostly boil down to three-point shooting contests. It just does. In the end, you can just look at every game and say, okay, just tell me who made the threes. You made 16 threes. You shot 39% from what threes. That's Yeah. So who are you more confident in? Dallas shot more threes seven of 27 from three. If Dallas makes 14 of 27, we're having a whole different conversation. If uh, Porzingis comes in and scores two points in the first half and two in the second half, we're having a whole different conversation. Did you just say if again? No, I'm just <laughs> telling you. This. You said, what can I fix? You said if Porzingis. No, you said, what are you going to fix? How about make five more threes, seven more threes? Then, then we're going to have a conversation on paper. But, but, went over five from three. If you told me papers was going to go over five from three, I'd be like, so you yeah, give no credit to Boston's defense that altered 
some of those missed shots. You, you just know. you just saw Kyrie. Did that no, look no, like no, great that, defense? No, no, I'm talking about. Yeah. I'm just talking about in general. That was all, yeah. those, so he's supposed to make all five. I don't assume he's gonna let's make. Give, I'm I not, said let's give him three. Go five I five. said let's give him three. Of them, three of them was. You open. gotta give. You hey. gotta skip. Give Boston some credit on defense. Every time I looked they had up, nine block hey, shots. Every time I looked up against the Oklahoma City Thunder, PJ Washington made another three and another three and another three, because and now he's in a slump. In but remember, yeah. remember okay, that's also a different three. defense that mm -hmm. they playing against. Oklahoma City plays really good defense. Yes, but really this, good. But defense. this defense that Boston yeah. is playing. Is so much better than OKC's uh, and even Minnesota's to a degree because Minnesota is playing team defense, mm -hmm. so it's a little different. Just make your open threes, and we're having a different. That's the easiest fix in the world. Just make your shot. Oh, so so yeah. so you, Jason Kidd, you going in the tape 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 room today? Guys, just make our open threes. No, That's you can't say it. You just got to do it. But see, we can say the same it. thing. So, what defensive adjustments do you make on Porzingis? What do you do there? You know he what? Li Lively took him in the second half. He got in foul trouble, but but again, he was he, he was causing big problems on Porzingis. Porzingis couldn't he get open on Lively because now it's size versus size, and it's quickness he, he versus quickness. He caught two quick fouls messing yeah. around trying to be rough. Yeah, yeah. But, well, I, I liked it. I, I thought it worked. You liked it? Yeah. That he, that he didn't it didn't work out. But a dude had to sit on the bench to the yeah. end of the game. Okay, Porzingis went one of four in the second half and scored two points. I'll take that. But they didn't need Porzingis <laughs> to do anything that. more in the second that. half. Those oh, games. okay. What yeah. else did they need? They were up by 20 something After damn he points. After he saved your season what in the first to half. What needs yeah. to happen? Make, Make threes. More threes. Yeah, because Luke will have 10 assists if you okay, start but, making but, threes. But, okay, and so, you know what? I'll throw this at you. There were multiple times in the second half when, when Luca tried to keep everybody else involved, and he would get a step on Jalen Brown or whoever was trying to guard him, Derek White, mm -hmm. get in the lane, and I'd say, you're open, you're open shoot it. And, and he instead, he would look to kick it because he's trying to keep everybody involved. Or, or, maybe or, next time, or maybe you just saw, shoot it. Or maybe he saw the center, the long, the long the dude long. standing there with his mm -hmm. long self, and he decided this is probably not a good hey. opportunity shot. Now, you say this, Skip. You say, just make your threes, right? Just hit your... It's pretty simple. What was Tatum? Six yeah. or sixteen? Six or sixteen. Just make some more shots, Tatum. Just make some more shots, Tatum. You did yeah. same How thing. about that? Since Dallas is underrated on defense, they're doing a number on him. Yeah, because yeah. Dallas is so great. And this is what I said. I said it yesterday. We talked about Dallas defense. I thought it was underrated because when you mm -hmm. look at the individuals on defense, yeah, they got a good system to where, you know, they can cover some things up and, and, and make adjustments, zone, switches, and, and things of that nature against flawed offensive teams. Mm -hmm. This team will expose that. Mm. You know why? Because now you get 37 points in the first quarter. Up 17. What's that? NBA record? Is that an NBA? Did I hear that correct? <laughs> Did I hear that correct? Was that the largest Yeah, because lead? a unicorn doing one because unicorn the largest If you lead, switch, it, if you switch it, Did I hear that correct? Mm. The, problem that, the problem that Boston, I mean, the problem that Dallas has is, first of all, they're not big across the board like Boston. So when you switch and you get a Kyrie on a Porzingis, you get, it's not gonna happen. Or you get whoever else that is on Porzingis, he go, that's like being in the backyard on your son. Mm. Just shoot from right okay. there. All and right. then when you decide you're gonna switch on Tatum, he's 6'10. So what? Is Porzingis gonna be finals MVP? I, you know what's declaring? so crazy? You know, you know what's so crazy? You said that, Skip. I told Nick this morning. I said, what if this dude is the finals MVP? Mm. You didn't even bench. think about yeah. it. You'd be embarrassed, but that's okay. Why would I be Why embarrassed? embarrassed? Yeah. I'm gonna be with him. I'm gonna be on the yeah. duck boat. Yeah. Who would be embarrassed? Okay. That would be uh, 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 that would right. be crazy. I'm gonna remind you both. Game uh, uh, one uh, uh, at Clippers. Mavericks are down 29 and lose badly. They bounce back in game two, yeah. and Luka goes yeah. for 32 and Kyrie for 23. And the, I, I know the, the Clippers didn't have Kawhi, but they had PG and they had James Harden and they had the guy you love, had, Russell yeah, Westbrook, they had, they the had reborn the Russ, right? Yeah. And Luka and Kyrie said, no, that's yeah. enough of that. Then at Oklahoma City, they get trounced in game one, and they trail by 25 in the fourth quarter. And game two, they bounced back, and it was lower scoring, and Kyrie didn't come to the party because he had only nine. But Luka had 29 in the, in the game two, and they won at Oklahoma City, and here they came. This is what's going to happen this in game pattern. two. This is, this the, is pattern. the pattern. This is what they're made of. The script. Yeah. That's it's, the script. Well, you got the script. Know, it's the script. It's the pattern. It's the history of this team. It's what they're made of. It's what they do. And so, we've lost two game twos in the, in the playoffs. Yeah. So 
you're you're talking sweep, or at least gentlemen sweep, and you already talked about what is this going to be a twenty point game, game two? If Dallas loses this game, because Dallas two, has no answers, listen, they have no. If solutions. Dallas loses game two, this series is over, and you know will it, it be a I sweep? Know, if Dallas loses this, will it Celtics be a sweep? A, no, no. Why did you I, say if? <laughs> yeah. When Dallas loses when? game, okay. So what, what do you think? By 20? What no, is no, I, I, I figure we'll cover the spread. Those teams that you just named, though, Skip, in game two, first of all, James Harden at times could disappear. At times. <laughs> yeah. Then you go to OKC. They got one dude, man, in Shea. That's it. They won more games than anybody in the I Western get that. I, I understand no. that. It's the playoffs. It ain't the regular season. Mm -hmm. You play the regular season, get to the playoffs. Mm -hmm. Playoffs is a different level. They led the league when in Minnesota, three point shooting. Minnesota got, the Minnesota got one guy yeah. that was teetering along, and then Cat got hot in that third or fourth quarter, whatever it was that he got hot in. Other than that, you got one guy. Okay. The problem with Boston, in my opinion, against Dallas, is they got multiple guys. They got multiple guys. That's the biggest problem that you have. The Mavericks still have the two best players on the floor when they come to the party, and one needs to come because he owes his team game two. When they know. come to the party. Yeah. 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 Okay. All right, I'll give you that. Let's just say Luka's the best player. Let's just say Kyrie's the second best player. Who the next four? Five. Okay. But when you got the best two, then what? you're good enough. You're going to win game two. If they play the way they are capable of, Okay, so what do you got to buy? 12, 14, hey, 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 I need hey, to know what you Check this out. You what, know, what, we won, the... well, we last won at 08. Mm. You know what they said? LeBron was the best player, right? Yeah. They said that, right? You know, when we went to the finals, you know what they said was the best player? They said Kobe was the best player. Say, man. That, that don't matter. Leave the Lakers that don't obvious. matter. <laughs> it don't matter. Well, he beat you that once, don't, no, right? No, 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 yeah. no, we was injured. Oh, was you were injured? injured. Oh, injured. oh, okay. Ray was, was injured. injured, yeah. yeah we was injured. Yeah. <laughs> it don't matter if you, you got the best player. You were wheelchair, right? Okay. It don't matter if you got the best player. Yeah. Okay, well, you're not saying you're, 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 you're avoiding the We issue. got the next four best players. Okay, but how many side. are you going to win game two by? I just need to I know. I think we win by about... 12. 12? Okay, I'll take 12 for a dinner. Deal? I'll give you eight and a half. Eight? Well, you just said the by 12. Why, why wouldn't you? Why would you? Are you scared? The spread is seven. Are you scared? I need I to mean, know. I might hit some you're luck talking shot. big Luka and you're betting a little. Lucky shot. Yeah? You might hit some come luck on. shot. I mean, come on, man. They, come they won on. by 30 this. last night. Come on. On a scale of one to 10, how confident you are in game two for the Mavericks? It doesn't matter because you <laughs> said it was by 12. <laughs> you're the one who said by 12. You're, you're, a, you're at a 12 on a scale of 12, one to 10. 12. Right? So I'll take 12 for no, dinner. No, I'm not taking 12. I'll give you nine. Nine? What, nine? what happened to 12? I need to know. You asked me how so many Luke, I thought I'll win, but the actual is probably nine. Mm -hmm. So if Luke and Kyrie step up their game, the Mavs win? Yeah, I told you they're going to win one of so these games, Lyle, so, so now they so, got to win so this if game. X factor, and I agree with Paul. They, they got to win this game. So if your X factor you know? is so lively, play the same way, and Luka and Kyrie play better, y'all still going to win? If yeah. your X factor lively, your X factor, mm -hmm. they still going to win? My, I, my X factor right now is Kyrie Irving. Oh, that now that's the, okay. Yeah, I All need right. him to. So you don't need lively to do. You don't need the young. Jason Tatum. Yeah. You don't need the young right, Lively exactly. to do anything. He can just do what he did last night. I, I thought he did pretty well last night. And, and yeah, again, I don't think he did pretty well. He'll be on for He didn't miss a shot, though. No. <laughs> he didn't miss a shot. Okay. He didn't miss a shot. He ain't missed a shot. I, I, will, I will also so bet you funny. another. I'll bet you another dinner. Porzingis doesn't score twenty points in this game. You want it? No, because we don't need him to. Oh, skip. We okay. don't need him okay. to score twenty. Right. Yeah, that would have been a sucker take, bet if you'd have took that yeah, one. I'll yeah, take twelve on. right now. I bet you going once, uh, twice, nine. nine. We got about nine. nine. Well, then you, you you don't have any guts. You don't Jason have that much Taylor conviction. Was nervous yesterday, and we won you by eighteen. Right. That's crazy. Okay. Well, we're going to talk about that next. Jason Tatum did say he was nervous <laughs> before last night's game. So, how does Paul think he handled the pressure oh, on his man. head? Thanks for watching, Undisputed fans. Do you want more highlights from the show? Make sure to click that subscribe button for all the exclusive content from Undisputed.